on Sunday content, um, I've decided to just keep it in one video, it just makes it easier instead of doing individual parts and getting lost and all that kind of stuff in your complete. So anyways, then it's getting through the first of tonight's bit of content that we'll run through and then obviously the upgrade SBC and so forth. So let me know if you're going to do all this and what you think of it and all that good stuff. So again, who is 84 rated, 79 pace, 82 shot, 85 pass to 1, 78 defending, 80 physical, 3 3. Go from 70 to 84, centre mid cam. Um, Shadow probably, I would probably consider him because I'm never stressed for free kicks. Uh, Mark 11 is who it is based on and um, yeah. Card has real potential, obviously if you show the form that you showed at the end of the like FIFA 23, um, this has a real chance for say um two free cards. It is also going to be important to remember that the tournament is won by like Mark. Um like ten points earned is a bit of an effort but a bit of a grind but should Run close to that. Um, game. Uh, sorry, playstyles is incisive pass, tiki taka, press proven, and relentless. Yeah, not a bad card for an 84 as long as it's not mad requirements. 84 flat with a league good player. It's not bad, not the worst. Um, I think we can all work with that. Just make sure there is nothing else clear SBC wise. Uh, it does not appear to be the case. Da, da, da. Max 89 icon, 83 86 with the team of the week needed. Yeah, don't know why. Uh, team of the week. Pfizer, <laughs> <laughs> playing Electron Players Pack. Obviously based around him and Ajax. So it's one Brazil player. Um, players from the same league, Max 3, players from the same country, minimum 4. Player, rare player minimum one player quality without a goal. So it's basically a gold squad from one. Um, best way is just keep to one nation. Like get Brazil done, but then elsewhere. That's the best way. I'll have to have a look what I've got. I can throw and make it happen because I've done three of the four already. No new icons, check objectives, FC Pro Cup I see. Interesting. So win one gets you an FC Pro loan pack. Well, okay, dokey. Win two gets you um, two rare gold players pack. Obviously, you've got a, it's explaining while having minimum one FC Pro live player in your starting eleven. So for most people's case, Jota will be your shout unless you end up doing one of the SBCs or pack someone. Win four gets you thousand XP. Win six is a one FC player pack. Win 8 is an 84 rear goal player, eight, nine, uh, win 9 is an 81 times 2, win 10 is 82 times 2 with the reward being a 45k pack. Obviously for doing Fizen today gets you more XP, um, I'm not claiming everything till the end, nothing else to sneak into milestones by look for that. Because that's what you've got to check because obviously the season's ending middle of the week. So let's have a look at the Evos. I, for what I've seen of it, I don't think Hibs can be done, so I'm a bit annoyed. Not annoyed, but not surprised. So it's plus 8 pace, plus 3 shot, plus 4 passing, plus 3, uh, sorry, plus 4 dribbling, and plus 4 physical. Right, so I'm all within three, 3 weeks expires and 4. Um, with the left wing with two new playstyles, including quick steps. So Mimeti goes from 80 to 84, who looks suddenly really decent. Um, so it's assist 5, play 5, so basically the same as what we did with Relentless Winger, you basically just put the controller down, go and do your own thing for 5 games, just jam it. Make sure you get, the I would say you get the 5 assists in the first game, get the opponent that you're playing and say, look, you're getting the win, just do whatever. Uh, second one, score 5, win 4 and win 3. Um, Personally, I would try and do what we all did for um, Rivals last night with Relentless Winger. We actually won the four matches. I feel good enough to still do that. Um, so score five, um, win four, win three. So depending who you use, it's going to be fun games. So 
best push that I've got at the moment, Elmas, Vera, Jose Perez, uh, Benina, um, Eleni Jova, um, Janizai, Trincao, Davidson, Trezeguet, Damsgaard. Um, it's not looking great, so if I go to Cinch, it's basically what left wingers. Left wingers in Cinch. What do you have for me, game? So actual left wingers, the only ones that can be done are obviously um, Hak Spanovic, who does no long, who no longer plays in the league, so that kind of scuppers that from Brit. Can they play left wing if I just set it to left mids? Love when the game does this. All I want is left mid game. I just want to know if, if it's worth oh my god. Jump back and grab and jump back out. It's just like I know I can check for GG and all that later, but it's just good to know just now. Um So Barry Mackay, Yuan couldn't even be done anyway because he's too fast. Forrest, Sims, Jair would be too fast anyway. Mackenzie, Murray. Um, yeah, I don't. Like, it's a free thing, but we didn't do the last PC upgrade. Um, oh, mind that was 50k, so that'll be why. Might do this, just see who um, fits it, really. Um, I'll have to have a look. So max 81 pace 8. I'll have a look. Because at the end of the day, SPFL team could get an upgrade. If we can't since we can't do a Hibs player. Um because obviously Jair and Yuan are too fast. And obviously McCurdy's not a right winger. A left winger, sorry, because he's only right mid right wing and striker. Yeah, so food for thought on that one folks. Um I forgot, do I have the SPFL team even saved anymore? Yes, I do. I think it's just all Hibs players. Um, right. Um, Cantwell, can he play left wing? No, he can't. Craig Taylor, I'm sure he's just left back, left by left wing back. Um, yeah, food for thought with this, really. I know I've got all the Hibs players in just now here. Yeah, so food for thought now and football. Let me know who you are going to do for um, PC Winger. How you're going, if you're going to do the cup and again moving all that kind of good stuff. So have a good one, folks. Take it easy, all. Thanks for listening, and I will catch you all later.